the baby baby came out and it, God, I was just it was a mix of emotions. I was on the one hand I was thankful that you know I did it. I gave birth and you know I did it and my husband is there and he's holding my hand on the other hand then we had to then face our baby who wasn't moving who wasn't breathing and they just they put her on the table for me they put a curtain there and I asked I want to see my baby and then they wheeled the table next to my bed and she was just there she just looked so perfect she just looked so beautiful she had my eyes had my nose had my my husband's lips and she had lots of hair and she just lay there so peacefully She looked perfect. She did. And um, they dressed her. They, you know, uh, they finished with me. And then we went and we spent some time with her. Took pictures, held her. And um, yeah. Yeah. And then I went home. We went home, all of us. Obviously a lot more happened, they had to discuss things that they had to discuss, the funeral, blah blah blah, I'm not going to go into that now, but we came home without our baby. At first when we came home, it felt like my life was upside down. I wasn't sure if I wanted to live, I would continue living, it just, the pain, the pain, the heartache is just so tremendous, you know, having a void. Because of course you've given birth and even though your baby has, hasn't quite made it, your body doesn't know that. And so my body has prepared itself for breastfeeding, for example, and so I had to go through that, even though there wasn't a baby to breastfeed. Um, just so much crap, you know, my family were really, really kind, you know, my husband and my family, they put us up in a hotel, you know, for as long as we needed to, to, to heal, and that was really, really, really sweet of them, but yeah, this is a moment in my life that I will never forget, my husband will never forget. We will never forget through everything that we do, we will always know that we had a baby. We lost our baby. Our baby didn't make it. But